Hello friends, welcome to the world of project management and Deal for an overview session on cost management. Motto of this training is to share my experience in preparing for BMP certification and I have prepared few slides. Friends, let's start with my introduction. I am Anil Kumar Dharam, based in the city of Nizam's Hyderabad, working in IT for 14 years and currently working as project lead and manager for from last four years. I succeeded in my certification PMP in 2019 and supporting two major projects currently and giving training on SAP and project management. Let's quickly move to our agenda for this session that we are going to discuss on introduction to the cost management, processes in cost management, key concepts, trends and emerging practices, tailoring considerations, agile or adaptive environments and activities involved in complete project cost management as per the Rita Mulki chat. Before discussing these topics, we will discuss first what is cost management and how it is related and the keywords in the general related to the cost management. Project cost management includes the processes involved in planning, estimating, budgeting, financing, funding, managing and controlling the cost so that the project can be completed within the approved budget. Here, some keywords we need to know on this cost management are life cycle cost, value analysis, cost risk, etc. What is life cycle cost? It involves looking at cost over the entire life of the product, not just the cost of the project to create the product. Let's give a small example here. Assume you plan the project to produce the product at a lower level of quality and save $9,000. That is saving $9,000. After the project is completed, the maintenance costs are $1 lakh over the life of the product. Instead of the $20,000 in maintenance, it could have cost had you built the product to a higher quality standard. Your $9,000 project savings cost the company $80,000 or $71,000 in additional cost. Here, we have to look at the cost of the whole life of the product, not just the cost of the project. Hope you understand better about the life cycle cost. Let's move to the value analysis concept. It's so simple here, that is, finding a less costly way to do the same work. It's also referred as the value engineering concept. Next, moving to the next concept, that is cost risk. It involves the cost, risk and procurement management. Overall, we can say as it's related to the cost risk. Now you have cleared about the cost management and its key concepts and keywords. Let's move to the actual definition of the each process involved in the cost management. That is, we have the processes in the cost management are plan cost management, estimate cost, determine the budget and control cost. These are the four processes involved in this knowledge area. Let's define each process by its definition. First, plan cost management. The process of defining how the project cost will be estimated, budgeted, managed, monitored and controlled is a planned cost management. Coming to the estimated cost, the process of developing an approximation of the monetary resources needed to complete the project work. Coming to the determined budget, the process of aggregating the estimated cost of individual activities or work packages to establish an authorized cost baseline. Moving to control cost. The process of monitoring the status of the project to update the project cost and manage changes to the cost baseline. This is control cost. In smaller projects, estimating the cost and determining the budget can be a single process handled by a single team or person. Hope you have cleared about the processes listed in the cost management. Let's discuss our next topic, key concepts in this knowledge area. That is cost of the resources, project decisions, financial management techniques that is we have return on investment roi discounted cash flow and investment payback analysis project cost management is primarily concerned with the cost of the resources needed to complete the project activities and also the project cost management should consider the effect of the project decisions on the subsequent recurring cost of using maintaining and supporting the product service or result of the project and the project cost management may address the processes and numerously general financial management techniques such as just I said return on investment, discounted cash flow, investment payback analysis. Fine. Let's move to the next concept. 
trends and emerging practices in the project cost management. We have expansion of the earned value management EVM to include the concept of earned schedule that is ES. Okay, let me explain this expansion of the earned value management. Within the practice of the project cost management, trends include the expansion of the earned value management EVM to include the concept of the earned value schedule. That is, earned schedule is an extension to the theory and practice of earned value management. Earned schedule theory replaces the schedule variance measures used in traditional EVM, that is, earned values minus planned value, with the respect to earned schedule and the actual time AT. Using the alternate equation for calculating the schedule variance, ES minus AT, if the amount of earned schedule is greater than zero, then the project is considered ahead of the schedule. And also the schedule performance index using the earned schedule matrix is ES divided by AT. This indicates the efficiency with which work is being accomplished. And also the earned schedule theory also provides the formulas for forecasting the project completion date using the earned schedule, actual time and the estimated duration. Hope you understand the trending concepts of the project cost management. Let's move to its tailoring considerations. In the tailoring considerations, we have knowledge management, estimating and budgeting, earned value management, use of agile approach and governance. As each project is unique, the project manager may need to tailor the way the project cost management processes are applied. Let's discuss one by one from the list. First is knowledge management. Project management has to check whether any formal knowledge management or financial database repositories are readable, accessible or not. And about estimating and budgeting, has to check whether the organization have existing formal or informal cost estimating and budgeting related policies or procedures and guidelines, etc. And coming to the urban value management, here we need to check whether the organization use the earned value management in managing the projects or not. Coming to the use of agile approach, here we need to check whether the organization use agile methodologies in managing the projects and also check how does it impact cost estimating etc and lastly about the governance part here we has to check whether the organization have formal or informal audits or governance policies procedures or guidelines hope you understand the tailoring considerations for the project cost management let's move to the considerations for agile or adaptive environments for this knowledge area here we have high degree of versatility versus lightweight estimation methods and high variability projects here the projects with high degree of uncertainty are those where the scope is not yet fully defined may not benefit from the detailed cost calculations due to the frequent changes. Instead, lightweight estimation methods can be used to generate a fast, high-level forecast of a project labor cost which can then easily adjustable as the changes arise. Hope you understand this. Coming to the next consideration that is high variability projects where here also, the subject to the strict budgets, the scope and schedules are more often adjusted to stay within the cost estimates. Hope you understand. Here, it's subject to the strict budgets. These are the considerations for the agile environments for the project cost management. Let's move to the complete steps involved in the project cost management as per the Rita Mulki chart. Let's discuss all the steps one by one. We have determining the development approach, life cycle and how you will plan for each area. Estimate activity duration cost, develop the budget, go back iterations, finalize all the management plans, develop a realistic and sufficient project management plan and baselines, take action to monitor and control the project, measure performance against the performance measurement baseline, measure performance against other metrics in the project management plan, analyze and evaluate the data and performance, determine if variances warrant take corrective action or other change request. Influence the factors that cause change, request changes, update the project management plan and project docs, and creating the forecast. This all steps involved in the cost management area. So we have covered the basic introduction to the cost management processes involved, key concepts, trends and emerging practices, tailoring considerations, projects with respect to the agile or adaptive environments, and the last activities executed in complete cost management. This completes the session and in the next video, I am going to discuss on each process in the project cost management in more detail. Thank you guys. If you like this video, kindly subscribe it and send your feedback provided on email given below. Let's discuss more on this 
plan cost management in the next video bye for now it's your anil kumar dharam